Thank you, Jesus. Whatever you face this week, forward still. <laughs> Whatever mountains come in your way, forward still. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever if you book at war, forward still. Ay, 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 ay. Disappointment come forward still. Ay, 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 ay. Woo. And if another pastor falls. Forward still. I'm telling the pastor we are following. We are being with pastor, but we are following Jesus. Forward still. Ooh. Young people, walk holy. Walk holy. Make the right decisions. Walk right. Walk holy, Ramandosia, Rakanda Rabasi on the Ramosha. Walk holy, forward still. It's Jehovah's will. Though the billows dash and sway. arthritis remedy and joint oil pain relieves muscular and joint aches arthritis sciatica headaches menstrual cramps foot pain and is also a great sleep aid manufactured by jamaican scientist everton brown phd from a blend of jamaican herbs shop www.jamsweet.com or call us at 813-679-0106 do you have a family member that needs care? Do you have a family member that needs protection? Call us today at Heart to Heart Home Nursing Home, located in Portmore, Jamaica. We specialize in home care and we do everything nursing. Call 1-876-465-4063. one 876 465-4063. That is Heart to Heart Nursing Home. We've been listening to you. We definitely been listening to you. So we got to do this just for you. It's Pain House Record presents the man himself, Redeem, talking about one of the badass, one of the best uprising artists right now. Keys for the Cage Mind with songs like Deception. Peculiar people. Every morning when we rise up, don't the river will swim. If you do not have no river, find yourself down at the spring. And you hear no one fit all before you. And a brand new single. This one's called This Is Too Redeem Much. Redeem say no more, this too much. Redeem say no more, this too much. 
Poverty lying the long bend till the book. We garrison here, we are them one fix up. Talking about Redeem, one of the fastest rising artists right now. Hey, you can find him on all social media platforms IG, Facebook, TikTok. It's Redeem Official. Or look him up right here on YouTube. It's Redeem Official Vivo. Hey, talking about good music, talking about authentic music, is right here. It's Redeem. It's a Painhouse production. Why you want wipe us from Jaja Earth? But for whatever lies worth. Hey, Babylon, I have seen you hurt. Babylon, we see your dirty words. Babylon, we dream still see you hurt. Who no say, who no disease affect you young baby? Affect pregnant woman and the elderly. People pause a minute and listen to me. This was well thought of and planned carefully. When you kill it, baby, there is no future for we. Population that you kill pregnant lady. Knowledge can pass and you kill the elderly. Where there is no brain power, you rule mentally. Largies, hey! Quaddy, thank you for pick me up at church early. Hallelujah! Lord God! <laughs> we are there. <laughs> when you see me go to church nice and clean. <laughs> Why, hallelujah! <laughs> hallelujah! When you know when me put on the white at a banger, I'm going to talk, you know. <laughs> Students! Students! They cut that film and we come in and want to pass the yes. Ada! Ada! We are tweet! Hallelujah! Net students! Courtney! Yes. Good night, you. Courtney! Yes, sir. You remember me telling you, say? Nesta Morgan was, was going to be a casualty. Her you don't remember? Short neck. Short neck. Are they in the court? <laughs> Uno wonder how many will have a right business. <laughs> what? Order! <laughs> Students, you can't call me from the 865 number. You don't have to call me from the 995. Lord Jesus! Students! <laughs> You're licking A! Hey! Students! One more time. Lord Jesus. Students, you can't call me upon the 865 number. I hit me a use for power the live. I love six. Lord Jesus. Mm-hmm. Where you are, say no. But remember, say me to tell you, say the... Remember, say me to tell you, say, bang, I'm going to keep you now. Yeah, you remember, me say too, no, say. Yes. Bang, I'm going to keep. Yes. Large, I wonder how me can... Do not disturb. Do not disturb. All right, it's a go work now. Do not call the 865. Yeah, hey. Lord, all right, my love. Go on, let me talk up the business. Talk up the business all right, mm. all right. Mm -hmm. Are they in the court? Are they in the court? Students, on a wonder, oh, 
Me know them business, so don't it? Only remember, no, you know, remember me said to you, say, next and I pass Sunday. Only never remember me said to you, no students, say, next and I pass Sunday. Hmm. Student, who remember? And me say, Still a G, eh? I so, so in a in a here and a there to to us. Mm. If, if they move, no move next time. Gonna whatever they move, I see and set up people them are uh, 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 have problem tonight, students. Students, listen to me carefully. Listen to me carefully. The Wi-Fi at my house is down. I am using the hotspot from my phone to do the class. Therefore, you cannot call the 865 number. Can you put that up? Do not call the 865 number. You hear what I said to your students? Do not call the 865 number. Do not call it. Because if you call it, it's going to trigger my YouTube stream. And it is going to trigger my TikTok stream. So nobody can call the 865 number right now. It will stop freezing. It will stop freezing once you don't call. But if you call, it is going to trigger the live. Do you understand now? Go into the comment and let them know. Do not call the 865 number. Is that clear? Almost 5,000 people reach your class just start. What a bangaran. Everybody expect me fi, fi carry the... <laughs> eh? Lord God, is it very clear? The only number to call tonight is the 995 number. All right. Let me cool down, students. Hata, hata. No? Kwani? Yes, sir. Students, say talk, teacher, talk. Speak. If you no want teacher to speak, say teacher, speak. Teacher speak. Hmm? Students. Well, it goes. Students. Are there in the court? Nesta. Shark neck man. Dirty Nesta. Dirty, dirty Nesta. Shark neck man. Wally goes. Shark neck man. Is who this a call now? Hello, good night. Hello, good night. Good night, Andrew. Yes, Carla, what you saying? Yeah, man, we know some of them are going to put them on. Because I'm going to preach. Yeah, Carla, but easy yourself. Let me talk up the things, them, no man. All right, Baba. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, it goes. Jacqueline. Jacqueline, when Nesta do? Nesta. 
Yadi da gwa like Yaraka Gibraltar. Yadi da gwa like you shall not be moved. Nesta on set up some super chat Zelda. Send up some stupid satans. <laughs> Lord Jesus. Courtney. Jamaica. Only remember, only did I go on like say. In my almighty God. Only hmm. remember, I go on like him very untouchable. Remember, students, I go on like say nobody. But Nesta. And not just the PR you have to resign from. You should have resigned as information minister. To... Let me catch it at a proper way. Dirty Nesta. Fratty Mount Nesta. Short neck Nesta. 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 Still and not taking no call, man. As where Derek Morgan say, I figure down two day, two day, two day, two day, two day. Desta, we done done with you yet, you know. The Rasta done a Clarendon, RJ Dixon go kick your way, you know. RJ Dixon go kick your way, you know. You see, like how Romy and Baxi in your mouth, what do you RJ go thump in your face and kick your dog. He may go kick your dog, Nesta. No. RJ, the, the Rasta doctor, done a, yeah, man, RJ Dixon. I go and see if I can't carry, la, Nesta, your political career almost over. Nesta, when Andrew did get the seat, what do you hear? You did think, say, you did think, say, all almighty, he move up and go on in the seat, you see. Courtney, if you ever hear the people that are clarin and talk about Nesta, Marga. Styling. They not have nothing good for say about Nesta Morgan students. Nothing good. When do so? When do? You never hear the people them call you and tell you say the, the man did kick him out of the yes. students. Oh, oh, remember the when they call and they call and say <laughs> Nesta team. get kicked out some party. At, at the house because he might keep a particular party, you oh, remember? You oh, remember? I never mean to say no. The caller, call and told us. So it's not, say, I did labor right them as central executive alone, disappointed in him. You know who is disappointed in him? The labor right them are clarin and said them are wait for the election. Don't it? So if Uno thing say, if Uno thinks a Nesta can run, students him can run back the constituency. You know? Him a one of them we can run back the constituency. You know? I'm going to say it again and mark my word the 21st of April 2024. Sunday. Sunday night, yeah. Mm. Nesta Morgan now run back in the constituency then you know, students. Students, on the ear what I said tonight, Nesta Robert Nesta Morgan shot net boy. Can't run back the constituency. Can't run it back. Can't run it back, students. So I'm just enjoy the perks right now. Remember, say, no other black are not really know the labor right business like me. You know? But remember, I told you all. From, I think it's Tuesday of last week. That theme day is numbered. I've been ill. I've been ill. You mash up NCB, them say. Large, <laughs> the labor right, them not easy. You know? Aye, the labor right, them say. Like, oh, you mash up sugar divestment. I am ma I saw you mash up, Lord Jesus. I've been ill. <laughs> Lord, the place at it getting at in here. Students, don't want me to catch you at and talk the things there. Students. Students. So, you know, so them get rid of I've been healed too. Mm. The labor right them. 
the labor right them say the whole of the money in the local government election me say the labor right them as what it sent mary the labor right them are west Milan. the will right them are anover say them no know we since i've been ill since i've been ill take over as treasurer for them party them say the money now filter on them say the adi the bramwell them say you know like <clears throat> no the ac and but the class the, the place hat 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 la jesus what on them man <laughs> Play a little David. Play a little David. No, sir. Play the David. Let me catch myself. All it goes. Drink it. Lord, for I want to go to heaven when I die. Lord, for I want to go to heaven when I die. We go here when child and go. Get something out here, baby. Get something out here, baby. Get something Yes, Finsack! Hallelujah! I've been ill. Your time now. I've been ill. You are the next one. Yeah, I'm a book, you know. Only things are pretty than alone have book. Me have my book too. Me have my nice clean book. It's soon done. I need a leisure. <laughs> Cause the many were coming on my book tonight, a bangaram. <laughs> Only think I pretty than alone a book. I years know me a book a right lesson plan. See my book here. Yeah. See lesson plan plan lesson. Look there. Look there. Lesson plan plan lesson. So if the minister education come, she can't fire me. Can me have me less no, but jupy jupy fever couldn't fire me. <laughs> Lord Jesus, I've been ill. Yes. The labor at said, I must ask you. <laughs> Lord Jesus, I've been ill. <laughs> Lord Jesus. <laughs> no, me have to drink the water. <laughs> Students in the world, me, Kingston 13. You're over here. Kingston 13, big up yourself. Why, Jesus? The labor right them. Say, I must ask you, Arbin Hill. Warm to the donorship, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Arbin. Students are some at at I don't know why they make them people are coming and me booking you know. The labor right them say I must ask you, Arbin here. What happened to the money? Money. We are no man. And no money is yet quote hey. Them say, I must ask you. What happened? To the money where they sheep them. <laughs> yeah, man, they sheep them. Dubai? Yes, Dubai Courtney, Lord Jesus. Yeah. Hallelujah. <laughs> Students, let me wrap me head before they mad me again. <laughs> Lord Jesus. <laughs> yeah, me look like the sheep them now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Abin, them say the labor right them say the money where the sheik them come give you a Andrew. 
Yeah, man. One night, the sheik them did. They come in at the con. Who do not remember? There was a one that I can't find it. Yeah, man. I'm going to find the picture. Lord Jesus. Mm -mm, no another one. Then. The man them from Saudi Arabia. Arabia. Only I remember last year when the Saudi. Sita students. I find it. Lord Jesus. I find the picture. Sita, I go and send it to over some producer. Them can't put it up. Lord Jesus. Mm -mm. See it here now. See the picture of the producer. I go and find the next one. Because I love the evidence. Don't you love when I present the evidence? You don't love when I present the evidence, don't it? Mm -hmm. It's not alleged this time, student. Mm. You remember when? See, see the <laughs> Well, on the man. Me I find the picture properly. It a come up, man. It a come up. Only I remember when Andrew, Andrew, the night in the cabinet office, see them with the sheep, them are Abel in the Abel in the day. The labor right, I know, say students. Only one me telling the truth. Mm -hmm. The labor right, them. Promise the sad man them, you know. Them promise them figure them river tan. Lord Jesus. Students. Maybe catch me at and tell you that one. Uno no say Andrew and I been ill. Promise the sad man them. River Tando. Only never hear that. Only never hear that. Andrew and Abin. Only never remember me telling about the bangarang where they go in at the meeting and and and, and Nigel Clark and Andrew are cussing in front of the Saudi man them on the, the Zoom channel and them have done the Zoom meeting. Yes, big bangarang. The only reason why you don't announce yet, students, it would have stir up too much ants. River Tan, see, see, this, see the students. Go over there and see. Go look. The Saudi man, they're going to get River Tan. Big money, them pay feet. Big, big money. So, them no say go and create problem because through them I got diverse the whole river. That is a big plan, you know. Andrew plan for use it for him third term. Mm -hmm. So because that I go happen now, some soft money did promise what is soft money. Save money and when the money for go through. Ah, Jay Dixon, big up yourself. You're going to kick when Nesta Morgan foot. Yes, students. So, the labor right them said the money. Is it true, Abin? The money where the Saudi prince did carry Pat Lodge. Abin! The money where the Saudi... La, I want to start up over here tonight. Abin! The labor right them said them one no. Warm to the money. What is sad the prince also get to you and Andrew Owens. Oh, them not get none of the money. Yes, 
rights, yes, students. The labor right them said them want to know how that big chunk of money come in. How that big chunk of money come in. And none of the counselor them, none of the caretaker them, none of the MP them, none of the minister them. So, I hear say one man up a Portland. I not call no name. Mm. I hear say, Lord Jesus, Mr. Unknown. the man of Portland say no more of this Tara Toro. No more of this Toro Toro. Uno, students, I hear say no. The, them go on bad up. I hear say Portland say, when you think of so election, Tara Toro with. When you think of so election, Toro Toro with. And I hear say the man, I hear say, beautiful speaking jump up. Beautiful speaking jump up, I say. The truth is, if I never get the donation from X, all it loud the place at. If I never get the donation from X, I couldn't let my counselors win. And then I hear say so one fat one from up in a Saint Catherine jump up. Prime Minister. I am tired of spending the constituency development fund. I am tired of it. We need some money. I hear the one from St. Mary get up and say, move out your bum. Move your tara. Them say, move your tara. So, I hear them say, I've oh, been Lord Jesus. <laughs> Uno know me always get them business at its best, no? <laughs> you know me always get them business at its best. I've oh, been. Them say me fi must ask you about our next money. Uno why no which next one? I sir. I've oh, been. The man them from India. Lord Jesus. So when me start up in here tonight. Indonesia. Hmm? The man them from India where you go panda trick day. He have been. Well, and they me catch back the yacht. <laughs> no, sir. Like Labor rights and Jamaica. PNP and everybody listen to me tonight. I don't tell lie, you know. I don't have no reason to tell lie, you know. Mm. I just start the truth that I know. You remember, students? Remember, me cool long again because I go. So, Abby, me, me, me don't want nobody to think I joke, me I joke out this thing. So, I go and ask the questions in a way. Hmm. I go and say no. Me is not a labor right, but them say when I ask him the questions, I must put on the art. Catch you at a lie. Me I talk up for the labor right them tonight. Cause the labor right them say them tired of your having here. Them say them want to know about the money we come from India. You remember that India trick there? Them say some money come from Israel when you, Andrew, and Nigel go down at Israel. Them say them not hear about no money contribution to the party from the Israel trip. Them say the trip where you and Kamina go pan at Dubai. Some investors did for come from that trip there. Where the money from the Dubai trip, from the investors, them say, them no know where the money they there. So, on a find it interesting, students. Say, so, all of Andrew surrogates them are resigned. On a find it interesting. Say, so, all of Andrew surrogates them are resigned. 
Think about it, students. Me and the labor right talk tonight. So I can't talk up the business. I can't talk the business. I'm going to hear clear, clear, clear. The labor right them say, since you have been here, come in. You choke them. You stifle them. Them mm. can't get no money for spending on them constituency. And them can't get no money for spending on the division. Then. So I hear say such man of Portland. Say I election season now. Lord, I sorry for the pain for them. I hear say such man from Portland said. Me I take over the treasury for the party. Me, I take over the treasury for the party. You don't know who such man is. Daryl Vaz, students. Mm. Daryl Vaz say, listen man. Me and you, Andrew Wallace, me and you, no friend, you know, but I prefer being government than to be in opposition. So listen what? It's because I know for run the money and share it equally. <laughs> Well, it's true, you know, Daryl, not mean like the rest, of, like Andrew, you know. Car. Hmm. Andrew have a way when him get the money, and only him, Chang, and Arbin. Little bit go to Nigel, dependent on the source, and Kumina. But what happened, students? Is a serious thing this is going in this country. Vast said too much, too much, too much labor right and suffer. Mr. What you said? I hear Vast say. Too much labor right has so far. So I say, let me get the money and share it up. Hmm. Only never said this week, leeching did in a vast constitution. <laughs> Lord Jesus. Let me ask it again. Only never said this week, Mr. Leeching did have spent some time in a Portland. Fully body guard. And him fully body gathered up in a Portland and him mm. and beautiful speaking toward the whole of Portland. Mm. I said to myself, interesting days ahead. I've been ill. And I just all alone, them are going to get rid of you. Know? Them say them, there is a plan in the JLP that is coming to fruition. And them say, what is the plan? A big plan coming to work. And I said to myself, what is that plan? I want to stay tuned over this platform. Christoph Tan. <laughs> hey. Tough gang. Tough stuff. How will we call him again? Tough tongue or what? Toughy. Toughy. Hey. I'm too. So, Warm to him. He may have enough money. Remember, so them say funeral old man he my friend, you know. Mm. And Daryl and he my big friend, you know. <laughs> Lord Jesus. <laughs> Del right Chuck, you come here. <laughs> Del right Chuck, you come here. Del right Chuck. I know I buy you buy. I buy you buy your way through last school, you know. Because you're not really so fixated on the law. Let us say fixated on the law. You're not so fixed. Let me put on back the white hat. You know, sister, when I put on the green hat, I sweat more. No, sir. Mm -mm. No, I'm not putting on no orange hat. It's not a PMP tonight. Let me say it again. Belly. Delroy Chuck. I realize that you're not so fixated on the law. What I mean by I know you're not that verse on the law. I know you're not well edified and uplifted when it comes on to the law. Hmm. Delroy Chuck. Who is advising you? And the Prime Minister. I want to ask again. Delroy Chuck. When there is a declarity 
judgment or a statement. Let me make it clear. There you go. There is no way, shape, or form that you can change the judgment and ask for a stay. You can't ask for a stay, then, Roger. And from Friday, the, the erudite gentlemen were over my platform telling you, you are wrong and strong. I heard that today in the meeting. The labor rights cuss you out. <laughs> I hear that at one point you had to go get the scotch. It's true, Delroy. Mm -hmm. I hear that you had to get the whiskey because you couldn't take the cussing from the labor right. I hear that mama Lashi say you was the next one that must go. It's true. Hmm? I hear that mama Lashi from mama Lashi from Olaba get up and say. That mother Tara 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 needs to Tara Tara Tara. As a matter of fact, Dr. Derek McCoy, Derek McCoy, I saw him near the Attorney General. You know the legal profession. Respect you, Dr. McCoy. Why you make Del Right Chuck make you look? No, I'm going to say thank you for the act. Catch you at a lie. <laughs> no, I'm a lie, lie. Yes. Mm. Dr. McCoy. Why you going to make the labor right there make you legal, luminary status come to now? Dr. McCoy. Why you going late? Your legal background that you're so well respected for. Come to naught with the labor right there. Dr. McCoy, you know the law. You are respected for the law. You were seen as a man who built the UA law faculty from nowhere to somewhere. And you go and make the labor right there mash up your name. In the legal circle, students, play with Mark. If Mark well enough to tell us if he resigned, it's really bad. The opposition <laughs> People's National Party is issuing this urgent statement to the nation in light of the government's confused response to last Friday's constitutional court ruling, which declared that the legislation to extend the tenure of the former DPP beyond September 23 last year is unconstitutional and void. Our objective is to ensure that the nation avoids the impending constitutional crisis that could arise should there be no acting DPP in place by tomorrow morning. As our eminent legal representatives have pointed out with clarity in their urgent correspondence to the government's legal team yesterday, the continuation of Ms. Llewellyn in her post beyond her lawful term is not only unconstitutional, but is also a grave misstep in governance. A copy of their letter has been published with our release to the media this afternoon to underscore the severe implications of ignoring the court's ruling. If the government adamantly insists on the former DPP continuing to purport to hold that office, her actions would no longer be validated by law and it could plunge the country into an even deeper crisis. Furthermore, the current absence of a public service commission whose term was negligently allowed to expire on the 31st of March this year without a new commission being put in place to ensure seamless public administration is a significant oversight by the government that could hinder ongoing public services, including the critical appointment of an acting DPP. Finally, it is clear that the public statements of the Attorney General, Dr. Derek McCoy, and the Minister of Justice, the Honorable Delroy Chuck, in the wake of the Constitutional Court's decision, represent either a profound misunderstanding 
or a deliberate obfuscation of the law as expressed in the judgment of the Constitutional Court. Their actions have fatally undermined their credibility as holders of those important offices. Accordingly, the People's National Party is calling for their immediate resignations as Attorney General and Minister of Justice, respectively. We urge this administration to consider the gravity of this situation and to act in the best interests of Jamaica's democratic principles and good governance. Mark Goldie. Mark G. It's so you must sound strong every time you talk. Mark Goldie. It's so you must talk strong every time. You so it's not just a matter of eloquence. You see all the sturdiness. You sound like him strong, like like him, Lobos. like him, 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 him take some um black stallion. Like Mark Goldie take some black stallion before him talking you know, on students. So Me say him so like him strong mm. and him ready. Yeah, man, it's like him take a black stallion before him speak. On the screen record it and tell him, Marky G, you so like you take a black stallion before you reprimand him. Yes, black Marky G, the black stallion a war. That is the Marky G. We want to hear going forward to deal with this wicked and caring government. But in truth and in fact, Jamaica, I want to say something to you tonight. I want to say something to you tonight that is very important. This government has no regard for the constitution let me repeat this government has no regard for the constitution i will repeat if you agree with me say Yes, teacher. This government, let me remind you, it was this said government who was told by the Constitutional Court that the use of state of emergencies were unconstitutional. And your Prime Minister Jamaica, decided to continue to use state of emergencies when the court said they were unconstitutional. What has it cost Jamaica to this day? Several Jamaicans have to be compensated, have to be compensated millions of dollars because of errors, because of constitutional blunders with men like Delroy Chuck. Marlene Malahu Ford, and recently Dr. Derek McCoy. I believe that with the replacement of Dr. Derek McCoy coming on board, you would have seen Jamaica. You would have observed Jamaica. You would have seen the transition in the way in which the government approaches things. However, students, if I recall, and you all to recall, that since Derek McCoy existence as Attorney General, we have asked Derek McCoy for his submissions to the government to be made public. And the Attorney General has been adamant to keep those declarations private. Coupled with that, Jamaica, Dr. Derek McCoy is known as a legal luminary that gives the best summations and arguments. And then when I see Dr. McCoy coming out to say, to interpret, this is where I said to myself, politics has really cost many of us in this country to lose 
our credibility. Politics has left some of us in this country losing our credibility. And what I mean by that, after the ruling on Friday, here is Dr. McCoy's interpretation. Dr. McCoy's interpretation is he's saying that one, the ruling by the, the judge did not say that Paula Llewellyn cannot continue as DP. And I said, where did Dr. McCoy get that interpretation? Where did Dr. McCoy get that interpretation? Where did Dr. Derek McCoy get such an interpretation of the law? Who gave Derek McCoy that interpretation of the law? I will ask again, students. Who gave Dr. McCoy that interpretation of the law? See there now? All that we discussed on Friday night, all we discussed on Friday night has now come to light. Have you seen what the Attorney General's department is saying tonight? They have to. No. Remember they said they were going to ask for an, a, a stay and then go to the Court of Appeal. However, students apparently I constitute a wonder if his doctor is Lloyd Barnett. I wonder if is Lloyd Barnett gave them in the interpretation of the, the constitutional lawyer. Because since evening, them say students, them going to appoint an acting director of public prosecution. But if the Labour Party and the government knows the constitutional well, they know and I am saying to you, students, it was said over here on this platform. You cannot appoint because there is a void. There is a clear void. So you cannot appoint. You need to give someone the position direct but in the United States, this country is operating as a party shop say party shop student. say party shop what do i mean by a party shop what do i mean by a party shop jamaica are you aware jamaica that there is no public services commission let me repeat that from March 31st this year, there is no public services commission. <laughs> Lord Jesus. I don't think no found or understand the implications for the country. No. Oh, no, sister, no government is running like a real party shop. Not even party shop. You know, like your name gravy and rice. Dunga, dunga dumpling shop. You know, like, how, you, how is it you have a government and you don't have a public services commission? How is it you have a government and you don't have a public services commission? Let me show you. I go and read the purpose of the, pos the public. <laughs> Let me read the purpose of the Public Services Commission. <laughs> Lord Jesus. <laughs> I, I want to tell you to say, Jai ride, Lord God. <laughs> I wonder what start me up in the night. 
I wonder if I don't want to reveal another piece of stinting students. Talk about the public first. No, but this is very important. Breaking news? We are no man. <laughs> Break the news, you make me, make me. <laughs> Break the news, you make me. Boy. Students. <laughs> <laughs> Ay, Jesus. You remember I spoke about gyroid parents? Who do you remember I talk about gyroid parents? You know, you all ask me, who are gyroid parents? <laughs> Aye. I was told Jamaica to look in a particular office. And I said, why must look in that particular office? Hmm. That office has some sim <laughs> is similarities or some names that you would question who they are to who they are. <laughs> Let me tell you now. I want you all to go research. I can't call them name over here. Mm -mm. And not going to call them name over here. But Here is what. The purpose of the establishment of the commission was to provide an independent and impartial body charge with the responsibility of dealing with matters relating to the appointment, removal, and exercise of disciplinary control in respect to public officers. At the time, the Public Services Commission operated out of the establishment branch of the Colonel Secretary Office located on Duke Street. The power was given to the commission to make recommendations to the governor general for public officers to be appointed, as well as to remove or exercise disciplinary control. This was enshrined in the 1959 constitution and at the same time provision for the delegation of functions of the Public Services Commission was made by the governor general acting on the recommendation of the Public Services Commission. So students, the chairman of the Public Services Commission, the, re the one that just now have no purpose anymore, is Mrs. Patricia Sinclair Macalla. Then you have Bishop Harold Blair, Mrs. Rose Bennett Cooper, Mrs. Brenda Cuthbert, and Professor Eldemeyer Shearer, Denise Eldemeyer Shearer. So all of them people are as no longer the Public Services Commission, you know. All of them expire, you know. So the first thing the cabinet tomorrow morning, I figure near me you now. I'm going to say this to you. The first thing the cabinet will have to name tomorrow morning. You hear what I said to you? The first thing the cabinet will have to name by 10 o'clock tomorrow morning is the Public Services Commission. You hear what I said to you? The Public Services Commission have to name by the latest 11 o'clock. And by one o'clock. So tomorrow, all of the lawyer, they make me tell you, all of the criminal attorney, them don't need to go to court till about Tuesday, Wednesday. You hear what I said to you? The criminal lawyer, them, so I, Satan, Champagne, Valrenita, Christopher Townsend, you, but no, not, no attorney not to go to court tomorrow. No. Them can't cock up their foot and lay down. Because 
Paula, so it's officially no students. Paula gone our yard, you know. When you hear what I said to you, so no court, no, no criminal court, no circuit court. So Albert Samuels and them man, they no need to go court tomorrow. You hear what I said to you? None of the criminal attorney them no need to go a court tomorrow. Because, remember, you know, Paula, pa, you see, mm -hmm. she's not going to hear again. Who are you? Who are you? You remember? So, Paula, but I don't think you remember students. Let me bring you back to history. You remember how Paula Llewellyn got appointed director of public prosecution? Paula, you remember something? I want you guys to go Google the Muirhead Commission. Remember to Google this. Hmm. The Muirhead Commission. Remember when Paula Llewellyn in 2008 or 9, those times I was in high school. Hmm. Those times I was in high school, you remember? But in 2008, she was appointed as Director of Public Prosecution under some very questionable circumstances. You know? and I remember. You know, remember how she frigged up, she messed up ju the um, Justice Pantry. Only now remember, and people said, do not give her the position. The Muirhead Commission students, I wanted to re re research the Muirhead Commission. That was how Paula Llewellyn became DPP, you know, under questionable circumstances, you know. She Fight out the wall of the people until she become DPP. You know? So you enter the office under controversy and you exit the office. Mm -hmm. Imagine you enter in a bangarang and you are left in a bangarang. You hear what I said to you? You enter in a bangarang and you are left. In a bangarang parlor. Everybody thought that you would have retired peacefully. Is that this grace reach arena? In every circle right now, but Paula, you have no problem because when you retire, you're getting almost 20 million dollars per year. You don't have to do anything more, Paula. You just have to cock up your foot and relax yourself. You're getting almost 20, at about 21 million or more a year, Paula. We know you wanted to become a judge, but then say you can't become a judge because, Lord Jesus. Paula, I feel it for you. you know? Remember, you were in a lot of social circles and you could talk, everybody talking about you, you know, Paula. Everybody talking. I don't know. Why, why she can't become a judge and not going to draw me out over here? I can't take a lawsuit. I can't take a lawsuit. But ask any liar. Then we tell you why she can't turn judge. <laughs> Lord Jesus. Then we call on a friend. Then call any liar and then we tell you. Say, no, what is me now? Oh, no, 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 what is me now? <laughs> Come. Tomorrow, Monday. Monday, by 11 o'clock, the latest, the Public Service Commission will be appointed. Mm -hmm. All right? Now, when the Public Services Commission appoint, Andrew can't just name the DPP, say no. He have to consult with Mark Golding. Mm. I want to say that again, students. Andrew cannot name the DPP like that, you know. Let me remind you. He will have to consult with Mark Golding. Mm. 
So, this week shall be an interesting week. No DPP in the, the nation's court. Students, I don't think many of you really understand, you know. I don't think you really understand the implication for the justice system when you don't have a DPP, you know. You hear what I said to you? What are the implications? But then I remember the Public Services Commission can't really name so quick, you know. Mm -hmm. The PS, <laughs> Lord Jesus. The Public Services Commission can name so quick enough. That has to go through another consultation with the opposition to it. So, I can't say the criminal justice system in our country should be closed down for probably two or three days. So, all of them, you remember even the keys. If there's no DPP, there can be no court. If there is no DPP, Jamaica, there cannot be any court. If there is no director of public prosecution, there can be no bail hearing. So all of the criminals who think them can go, go, go get bail tomorrow. On a quarter, like a set of probably right now, you know, every case that the DPP has gone back now, you know, so all the vibes cartel kids, all that the vibes cartel kids, we know, Lord Jesus, you know what, you know what, I'm going to say this to you all. People must know when to dance. We have never in our justice system in our country ever had such a chaotic, disgraceful system. I remember Jamaica from last year People thought that I was joking. From last year, I said to Paula Llewellyn, Paula, I said to Paula Llewellyn, Paula, go and plant some flowers. Orchids. And Courtney, go out the door and you look in at the garden, past the orchid. Come my orchid are blooming now. Sure. Go for me, orchid, care come, Courtney. As you go out of the gate, you see it. Care me, orchid come. I go and say it again. Paula, I looked at you and I said to you, plant some orchids. I will use my platform to get your customers. You remember? And you look and you continued and you believe as though you're unstoppable and untouchable. Unstoppable and untouchable. And I said to myself, when are you going to stop? Right now, you're the biggest clown in the justice system. L.A. Lewis look like, make you look like one big idiot. Because many will argue that when L.A. walk the Obi upon you, what day you see come to fruition. Many will argue that when Andre Stevens did tell you last year, say, go and go retire peacefully. Go and go the thing. You never listened. You never find it.
No matter how good you are, if you stay for too long, you spoil it. A good dancer must know when to leave the stage. Look here, Paula. Look here. Beau Paula, this never bloom from the start of the year. You know when it bloomed? This started to bloom Friday. Look there, Paula. This orchid started to bloom on Friday. See there? There are more orchids up there must shoot. Look there. It never bloomed until Friday morning. The orchid is a symbol to remind you that I told you. No, the orchid, you know, land the orchid that they are dry. And I said to myself, how comes the orchid bloom? But the orchid bloom because you must know when to exit the stage. You must know when to exit the stage. Paula Llewellyn. See, there in a TikTok. Look how the orchid beautiful. Look how the orchid beautiful. But the orchid is a symbol of hope. That man like vibes, cartel, and the rest of them. Justice, hallelujah. Freedom is coming tomorrow. Paula. I look at you. How many times I told you to retire peacefully? Look how they are. Kapala, one of these orchids are like three, four thousand dollars. And the truth be told, see there. The truth be told, Lady Paula, if you did start the orchid farm from last year to this year, you know. Padna draw and many other bloggers would help you sell your orchid. Even Cliff Hughes would have helped you sell the orchids. Nationwide would have helped you sell the orchid then. But no, all of the uptown people we deal with would have helped you sell the orchid. But no, Paula, your hell bent, Fisidum, as DPP. I don't know I'm going to say this tonight. I have never said this before. But I'm going to say this tonight. Don't be surprised that Paula Llewellyn is sick and dead quick, you know. <laughs> Students, don't be surprised Paula Llewellyn is sick and dead quick, you know. Because you have some people in their career, when their career not go the right way, Lord Jesus. I don't know my mouth. When it talk, it really talk in a student. My mouth not nice in a student. But students. Should we take strokes? Should we take strokes over it? You know why, students? I sat now go talk it, but me can't talk it tonight. In a parlor Llewellyn's mind, she must be the one to mash down vibes cartel, you know. Tear him up, you know. Send him away and lock him down. And where she now go get the time to mash up vibes cartel? Courtney, mark my word, you know. Students, mark my word, you know. She, you know, when she think, says she now go get the chance, students. From mash down vibes. Think about it. Paula, I go remind you, see all the work you work. Africa, you don't remember what day when your ear said she did take a quick break and she did go to Africa. No more dopey magic. No more, no more guzu and rituals are going to work for you, Paula. Paula, put this up, there's a quote name. 
put it out there so it go stay with me till the prosecute. No, yes, man, right there, so right beside my mother, Edda, yes. Thank you, Courtney. I want to remind the students. You remember the time when she did go to Africa? Only remember. Excursion. She go to Africa when there was the big alabalu about her extension. And you hear said the DPP gone to Africa for three weeks. So you remember. And when she come back. When she come back students. She get very strong and attack up, talk up and go on. I mean, look, somebody call me, you know, send me one video one time, you know. Because my students, them are ramping you know. up. Them see her alone in a mega mart, a shop. And them must say, how that woman you so high profile and deal with so much wickedness? Oh, she now walk with no security. But I said to the person, she just come back from Africa, so she charge up. Because the purpose, the person sent me the picture and I said, Teacher, I think that was aunt, Auntie. No, me am not call her. Who. Make your Auntie, Auntie, you know who you be. So I said to myself, She come back from Africa and she's strong. But then I hear say, <laughs> I hear say students, I hear one woman this morning and tell one we for use <laughs> for run with the dopey. <laughs> me say, what you say? One woman must use for run with the dopey. Wow. The woman say, if you buy rice, <laughs> rice, white rice, <laughs> rum. I will I admit it to me, send it to Sasha Ice. <laughs> me send it. To I sat. Me mm. said it to I. Let me see me find it. Me say what a backside. Damn it. Hear the woman say. I wait there. Mm. See me find it. Well, Paul, hello, Wendy. No, we know. Hello, Louis. Congratulations. You do it. Coffee. Coffee. Me not take club. Me not take film. One of me. Mm. You do it. Hello. You know because you're smart. Yeah, you know. You know what rum, cigar, coffee, and rice can do. Rum, cigar, coffee. <laughs> rum, cigar, coffee, <laughs> and rice. I don't work with them something. They're not students. <laughs> you hear that? But the woman say, <laughs> blow for blow. So like how she go to Africa. You woulda used the rum, the cigar, the coffee, and the rice. Mm -hmm. Them say, Lord Jesus, I not taught them something. They no students. I don't use rum, coffee, cigar, or something. You know what I use? <laughs> Psalms ninety-one. Only one. Come, no students. When me use Psalms 35, me no need to use rum, coffee, cigar, and then something there. I have to use Psalms 91. Tell me the Psalms we only use. Lord, for I want to go to heaven when I die. We go here when child and go. Get something out here, baby. Get something out here, baby. Get something out here, baby. Well, on the students. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When you must re up on the Psalms 23, 27, 120. 
No, 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 the Psalms them for you. Paula, let us say this to you. You see, if you did just walk from last year, if you did just have the decency to walk, the respect, the honor, the pride, the dignity to walk from last year, a lot of people, a lot of people would have said respect and continue. No matter how good you are, but if you stay for too long, you spoil it. A good dancer must know when to leave the stage. Yes, students, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Students are asking for one final time. Do not call me on the 
what's the number the 865 number it triggers the a, a getting a just a moment a getting a development I think a, a lot of people want to hear this development. Mm -mm. Hold us to a second, student. Mm. Hey boy. No, this is Andre Stevens. All right, yes, said boy. Yes, Andre Stevens. Good night from Good Night Partner Draw. This is Jamaica Hot Topic with my guest in studio. Good night, Andre Stevens, Jamaica and the world. How are you doing tonight? Well, well, what 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 is the development? All right. Now I have my guest on the line and uh, I greet your audience, your audience and everybody. Now, it is in regards to something that is happening with regarding the water. You realize that Jamaica is being plagued with a water crisis? Yes, what's happening with the water crisis? Well, my guest is on the line. I'm going to allow my guest to inform you about some plans because sooner or later, there are plans afoot that the, the, the water treatment and the water system and water commission will be privatized. And sooner or later, 600,000 Jamaicans or more will be paying water to private people and all sort of something. So my guest is here to give you the rundown of that. Good night, my guest head boy. Welcome but that's not program. a surprise. Night, I spoke boy. about it. Mm -hmm. Give us the details. Our host and our professor, we are very loyal to. Professor Andre Stevens, the greatest debater ever lived in Jamaica. Yes. Mm -hmm. So so let me quickly jump to it, Professor. What is apparent is that there is a contract, and it is real. There is a contract between a company called Rear Cobre Water. Yes? Mm -hmm. Now, this company, let me give it a proper name. It's called... Rio Cobra Water Limited. Mm -hmm. Yes. And this this company's aim is to so they are doing a project in the Rio Cobra area. And you know that's the same cash in area. Yes, the Prime Minister and launched it recently. Mm -hmm. Right. They're using that water to supply the parishes of Kingston and St. Andrew and St. Thomas. Now in the agreement for that contract mm -hmm. what we see is that they first of all they obtain their funding from the idp and you know what the idp means in the national development bank yes now the they received the funding to the tune of 30 million dollars 30 now, million what, us and we're talking about us right yes 30, 30 million, million us dollars Mm -hmm. Hey boy, the people them say must turn up your volume, turn up your volume, talk a little right. bit louder. So 30, 30 million dollars. US dollars. Right, 30 million US dollars. Mm -hmm. So Rio Cobra Water Limited entered into a contract with the, with the government of Jamaica through their principal entity called Rio, called, um, let me give it the right name, let me give it the actual name. But I spoke about this already, you know. called Vinci, Vinci Construction, yes? Mm -hmm. Vinci Construction. So Vinci Construction is the principal operators of Rio Cobre Water Limited. What Rio Cobre Water Limited is supposed to do, they entered into a $30 million, a $12 million, $12 million US dollar contract with the government of Jamaica. Uh -huh. And what they're supposed to do through this con contract is that they're supposed to develop the Rio Cobre Water Supply Treatment Plant 
and they're going to use that water to supply Kingston and St. Andrew, Port Moore, um, and St. Thomas. Mm -hmm. And what they will do, they'll have over 600,000 customers, and they will have a contract lasting for over 23 years, mm -hmm. and with an extension of five years, which would almost bring it close to the 30 years, which most agreements would be negotiated at. Mm -hmm. Now, my concern about this contract, Professor, is that the public was never informed and what really is also ironical about this contract, why is the government of Jamaica supporting this private company that has been led by Vinci Construction, who, by the way, they're very good at what they do. We're not here to, to disrespect anybody. These are professionals. Mm. But we're saying, why couldn't the National Water Commission and the National, or the National Irrigation Commission act as the principal owners of the project and then Vinci Construction come in as the technical experts? Mm. And then what would happen? It would put the Water Commission in prime position to actually go back into the scale of earning. Yeah. So what you're telling us about the address, what address you said this company, because this is a private company, right? You're saying that this Vinci is a private company. What is the address of this of this country of this company, sir? So so under the OUR, you know, in order to, to become a utilities company where they're doing sewage, light, water, mm -hmm. you have to get regulation from the OUR. Their application to the OUR, which occurred, which occurred during the, the period of 2023, um, of February 20, 2023, mm -hmm. their address they listed was NWC Constant Spring Water Treatment Plant, Long Lane, Kingston 9, and that sounds like a upper Stony Hill. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what you what you're getting at about the address? I am saying, how could this private company be registered, its registered address be at a NWC treatment facility? How could it be? It's a private company, you know? He's saying that their address, the company's, a private company's address, is the same address registered as the NWC treatment plant out at Upstone Hill. So we're trying to find out why is it that a private company is registered in the same address as the water treatment company? Don't you see that as a conflict of interest, Andre? If a company will register a company, it must have a business address. So are you telling me that the business address of this company, which part, which 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 in a contract with the government, the same address is listed? as the water treatment location. Something look fishy about that, Andre. Could it be that is a shell company and I cover them, I cover up some for push some money through it? I want you to think about it. Why is it that the company address is registered at the National Water Commission treatment plant and it's a private company? Interesting. Yes. So I want you to press. Because I know you have people left, right, and said, I want you to press on the matter and dig deeper because we're trying to find out what is the relation. So you say the, the company name company. is Vince. Let I just. So the company's name is Vince Construction. Right? They're the principal operators of Real Cobra Water um, Company Lim Water Limited. Real Cobra Water Limited. And you said they are the Rio Cobra Water Limited. And you see, when you research Rio Cobra Water Limited and the Vinci Construction, you're seeing the address to be up by Stony Hill at the Water Commission? Yes, because that is their application to the OUR. So I'm referring, I can actually send the application to you. Where they remember the OUR has to publish companies who apply for um, utilities. So, your um, argument is that this could be a I, shell company created? No, I would not take that, 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 that stance because I'm very guarded as to this. Because it is declared that Vinci Construction owns Rio Cobra Limited. There's no, there's no animality where that is concerned. Mm -hmm. There's no mystery where that is concerned. My concern, Professor, is that why is it that this D 
deal is being done in such a way that the general public is not aware that a private company would be operating our water distribution channel for the next 25, 28 years. When we could have done the same through National Irrigation or the Water Commission, because what the government of Jamaica did is that they backed this application by Vinci Construction, who is Rio Cobra Water Limited, to the IDB for 30, 30 million US dollars. We could have had that, for, that money could have been backed by, we could have backed that. Yeah, so I'm saying, who are the principal operators of this company? It's only one man me see as the principal operator. Well, I've just done my, I've just done my research quickly. And Vinci Construction is at Long Lane Post Office 1481 Constant Spring Road. So is that where the Stony Hill yeah. operation is? That is where the, that is where the plant is. When you come up on Stony Hill Road after you pass mm. Stillwell Road. Uh -huh. Yeah. And you come up, come up. Remember, you have the first water commission treatment plant and meet the yeah, you know, yeah? yeah, between where where Orange Grove be, right at the crossroad of the past, still a road coming up, right? So that is an NWC facility. So how it is that this private company, mm -hmm. right? Even let me let it be clear enough. They have a relationship with NWC. In the fact that they are they have entered into a private arrangement with the NWC. So no one is denying the relationship they, they have. Well, they probably have what is private. probably what is the case is that they have an office on the compound of the NWC. Could that be the case? Well, if that's the case, no one is uh, I am not arguing about that teacher. What I'm saying is that it is quite ironical, it is quite weird that a private company, right, of this nature, because we're talking about Vinci Construction, they're a worldwide company. They have operated in many countries, and so I'm not degrading what they have done over the years, but I'm saying, why is it that there is such a close relationship between this private entity called Rio Cobre Water? Remember, Rio Cobre Water Limited is different from Vinci Construction. Yeah? yeah? Yeah. All right, I, I think I'll look into this more. Cause I well, need to all right, teacher go looking at it. Teacher go looking at it and then we discuss it. Anything in fine, you can bring it further to him. All right. What I would say, what I would say it worries me that six hundred thousand Jamaicans will be paying for water from the real cobra for the next twenty three to twenty eight years without any explanation from the government as to what is the arrangement between this private company? It needs to be known. This is a private entity entering arrangement with the government of Jamaica, which is to call. We have never had a private entity in, in, involved in water distribution through, through Jamaica mm. like that, you know. All right, yeah. I will look into it. I will look in. go and check into it. Go and All check right, into it, teacher. God bless you. God right. bless you. Yes. Mm. Yes. yes. Bless you. Students, I will do my, I'll do my independent probing. probing to see. But remember, students, I've been saying to you that very soon, mm. Oh, interesting. <laughs> oh, what is Pawe? Why them want to send me? Interesting students. I'll look into something and come back to now. So, Anna, just what alone them do? Backside. Why them love when teacher go research things? Cobra, what is? Vinci Highway. 
So I them have the contract for the highway them too. Vinci construction. You see there? <laughs> the students in the car and throw me off so much, you know. In the car really throw me off with so much in things, you know. Uh, one brain this one. may have one brain. One brain I have students. One brain. I is it from the brain that the Pampala tonight? The brain can't reach a Vinci. The brain can reach a Vinci. But remember, I said to you, students. Remember, I said to you, and think about it critically. I said this to you all, that in another 10 years, I'll just reiterate and then go back to Paula. In another 10 years, the issue of water in this country will be privatized. Remember, I said it to you all. And it's something to discuss. Members of different sectors reached out to me about the argument. And I said to them, in due time, you will see it. And I said, why I argued, the only reason why, the only reason why Jamaica The privatization of water has not been done, thank God to the United States of America. You recognize what I just said? Thank God for the United States of America. That's the only reason why a major water project has not been announced as yet. Because when Nigel Clark went to that meeting with Andrew Holness and Kamina Johnson-Smith in 2022, they were told, to back off. They were told to back off of Chinese investment in Jamaica. They were told. That is why Jamaica, you have not seen a greater influx of the Chinese in Jamaica since then. Are you aware of that? That is the goddamn truth. It's the goddamn truth. But as I said to Paula Llewellyn tonight, as I'm about to wrap up in the next 10 minutes, you must know when to walk away diligently. I feel it for the people in Spanish town. The police have killed about three men in Spanish town in the last 48 hours, 72 hours. Mm -hmm. Termite dead. Termite married a week ago or something of that sort. Mm -hmm. And when termite come back a Spanish town, they kill him. But according to the police, termite had a history of blood gangsterism and extortion in the parish. So termite has left us. Then kill one next one at John's Road. And then kill them them kill a lot. And and I'm saying to myself that wow this is a well this is termite Jamaica. I don't know much about termite. Them say Sir P have him file. I don't know who have him file from who don't have him file. I don't want termite file Jamaica because I don't know. I don't know a criminology like that. Is when them go in a day, um, the police system. I will touch on them a little on here. But I don't touch on criminality like that. Hmm? Yeah, man. So I will leave the termite argument because I do have no big gun 
and I do have no pyro for spray, no termite. I like me they tell. I do have no beer gun and no pyro for spray, no termite. But you know what I'm saying, and I think this is true. I don't know me always start the truth, all when it's controversial. You ever wonder how the police them spend so much time? A killer of the PNP done them, but the labor right done them still a live. I'm going to ask it again. You ever wonder how the police them a killer of the so-called PNP affiliated dance, but the labor right done them still a live? You recognize that, me just as say, even in the courthouse, you hear about a major trial with the clansman them. Why come there's no major trial with the one other man them? Me just a ask on the students. Me want to ask on a question. Me, me just a be fear. Me just a be rational student. One to the whole heap of one other man them where I get trouble in a Spanish town and right cross Jamaica. How comes them not have no keys a courthouse? So you're telling me, who have to ask unless me a fool fool? Are you saying that the only functional organized gang in this country is the Klansman? We want to ask again, students, because Look like me a fool and you a fool. But me want to ask, it's not a matter of leave alone. But me want to ask the question tonight when me I end the program. Yeah. You are going to tell me, say, the only organized gang in a this country where them can catch are the clans, man. You can't catch one other and none of the children other the gang. Stone crusher. Stone Crusher, Moby, and all of them, something there. None of them gang, they can't get nothing. Lord Jesus. Students. Yes, my say, Andre, leave it alone. This is not your fight. But I want to ask you this question as we leave tonight. I want to ask you, students, me not, me not have nothing, me, no, no gang now go kill me or them so, because not for the gangster them rape me no. But me want to ask it critically to tonight, students. Me want, nobody now go ask the question, but I am little David. I am little David, students. So I go and ask the question. You are going to tell me, say, Kies Farm, Pan Clans, man. 60 odd man go a court. No case no farm for stone crusher. No no farm for um, one other. No no farm for West Kingston. No no farm for the Clarendon gang. No no farm for Joel and them them. But I want to ask you tonight that a holy clansman, no man, truth and justice must prevail. Truth and so you ever tell me, say, a holy Tetra Miller and the whatsoever, a gangster in the country. Look how much, remember, in you know, Aureus Chang says, students, there are almost 300 operational gangs in this country. And you're going to tell me that is only one gang. Only one gang. So they're not meaningful when they matter about deal with crime. Unless they are politicize it for prosecute. Unless them are politicize it for prosecute everybody freed everybody freed but that is why we no longer go have Paula Llewellyn 
That is why Jamaica only not boy have Paula Lewelling. Hey, when Paula go a court, she lose case like nothing else in them. Paula, hey, students, the only strength Paula have a few vibes cartel and them and then. Only not hear what they are right. Only never hear all what they are when she go a court. How much man get released because her evidence never strong. But I'll leave the argument for the answer tonight, students. And I want you to, I want you all to one follow up on this argument tomorrow night. I'd invited a guest over here, but I want you to listen to where KD night. Play where KD night have said about Paula. Everybody you know what bothers me? What bothers me is why is it that there is such an insistence, such a, a desire, such a thirst, which can only be quenched if Paula remains DPP. Why? Why? Why are they going out on this limb for her? Why? There must be an underlying reason. And there is no sparsity of persons who can fill the post. None. It is an odd situation. And quite frankly, I will tell you, it is so odd that it bothers me. And, you know, I, I don't want to speculate and won't speculate because that would bother me more as to why the extra effort. I, I, I am troubled in mind. And Paula should just be graceful. Be graceful, Paula. You had your turn. Remember how hard you fought to get pantry out? Remember? And know how hard you're fighting to stay in. Not right. Have a sense of justice. There are persons in the department who expect to become DPP. But the way you are going, they will find themselves on the retirement list before they can get there. Something is not right in the state of Denmark. Something you hear with KD saying. You remember how you dealt with pantry? You remember how you dealt with pantry, Paula? Paula, you remember how you dealt with pantry? Paula? Let good... Well... You know what I will say to you, Paula Lewelli? I sent you a WhatsApp on Friday night and you read it. But you never responded. See there, student? I sent her the WhatsApp in. You know. See the corny? You know, see she should read it. Yes, read it. It's a blue tick. See the blue tick, the students? <laughs> <laughs> Me tell you, say, I did I go send it to her, you know? See the reply. I send it to our students. And see, there is fear number. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I send that. Uno, uno rang me for sending students. Tell me if Uno rang me. Play back short. She fight. Up. No matter how good you are, if you stay for too long, you spoil it. A good dancer must know when to leave the stage. 
You're wrong if you send it to her. But I believe when I sent it to her, she let good sense prevail because she said to the attorney general that she won't continue in the position. But you see, that is what happened when, according to some media houses, let her stay because she's she's accessible to the media. Can you believe? She's accessible to the media. But students, I'm not afraid, like some people, you know, to send message to the 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 the, the, the powerful. Echelon of this society. I take up my phone and I send them the message. If them want to answer, them answer. And if them don't want to answer, them don't answer. But you see what I said to your students. I don't know what it will look like. I don't know what it's going to look like for her in retirement. Honestly, I am not the type of person to wish any man bad luck. But I honestly believe that, and this is something too, that a lot of you might not know. A lot of you in this country and across the world don't set up a pension plan. I don't know if she, 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 she should set up a pension plan or whatsoever. But in her case, one, she can become a legal consultant to the United Nations or the one of those international organizations. Or she can become a legal consultant in the Caribbean. But then again, no, but the, the Caribbean will not um, accept her. I don't think nobody in the Caribbean would accept her for... Yeah, no, me and Matlin, I take up Paula Lowell, you mad? You, you think say Barbie does people them? <laughs> she, she probably can go bellies. Or one of them, something there. Um, um, I don't think she should do any more law. What's the plan I think she should just go get some lands. The orchids. What else do you think I must give our students? What else? We must say 20 million a year now. What else do you think I must tell her to go do? Can we address that too? Address that? No, Kony, what kind of address on a one style? But I One style, she, she know what to do. Not what go a parlor for hairdressing when she done my She need to take the money and go around the world. Paula, I will tell you, one of your friends, one professor. Yeah, what are, you know what she can go do? She can go up at UWE or you take go lecture. Ah, that, that, I, I will find it. Now. Yes. Go up a uh, U A U uh, tech. Go take up. Um, she can't even go to the dean of the faculty of law. <laughs> Why? And she's very good at the English language, you know. She's very good at it. You know that. And, and you know how she run up her mouth. Yeah, and she's yeah. she very eloquent, man. <laughs> yes. She can't go be a lecturer. No, Paula, no. Lead, be a lecture. Hey, but Paula, teeth and tongue, so me fi tell you good riddance. <laughs> Paula, them say, when, <laughs> when me tell you good riddance, we must catch your ass. <laughs> so long, bye-bye. Hey, so long, bye-bye. <laughs> Goodbye to you, Paula. Goodbye to you, Paula. Paula uh, mm -mm. Oh. No man but Paula catch her at. <laughs> mm. 
Turkey. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. The next time will be on, on Jay. The next time will be on Jay. Them say the parlor, them say your father have no land. <laughs> Whoa, them say your daughter study law. So you can go help her finish up. Mm. Mm -mm. Next to them, say me to tell you, say. Them say me to tell you, Nesta, pack up your things from Donga Clarinda. Away RJ Dixon. <laughs> pack up, away Miss Norris, man, tell Paula. Yes, Miss Norris. No, she's the woman not to do again. <laughs> Talk the things, them, no, Mama D. You know, you must get, you know, you know, um, I was already set the place so she can't go there now. Where she figured to me, lady? Ask Sam, Vibe Cartel. <laughs> Where you say? Ask Vibe Cartel. I don't know what you mean by that. Come off, all the man, come off for the phone. Come off for the phone, all the man. <laughs> <laughs> You have to have respect. 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 Hey, come off of the phone. You have to go down today. Today, today, today. Mm. Mm. You, 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 you don't have no manners, you know? You don't have no manners. Smarty said, Paul have no cop and land in a clarinda. Oh. Mm -mm. Mm, she can't go. Paula, me go, me go. You know me should have provoke her. You know me not provoke her. No, me I leave her alone. You can't text her again. Mm. Mm. You can't text her again. Somebody say, Andre, money is not the problem. Power is the problem. I know power is her problem. Power is the problem. Them mm. say, can't, probably... Consider opening up an adult daycare facility. No man, I think she will do well with the um lecturing. the flowers and the lecturing, don't it? I think if because the flowers will give her therapy in the, the day, and then the the law, the law student, she will do well lecturing, you know. I go don't you think that's a good combination? The flowers. To do the farm and do the lecturing part time. Mm -hmm. Students, remember to bless up the super chat. Bless up the super chat, students. Power is our problem. But students, remember, I tell you, you know, she don't get therapy. You know. She going, she going dry up. She going dry up quick, quick, quick. She going dry up quick, quick, quick if she don't get therapy. Students, Paula Llewellyn has dedicated all her life to public service, you know. Mm -mm. Hello, good night. Tisha, good night, how are you doing? I am good. Yes, uh, Tisha, I, I enjoyed it, the program, teacher. Very you very enjoyed nice. the program. A lot of people were here tonight. Yeah, man, it's very, very nice. Mm -hmm. But anyway, Tisha, the people in this small and say, we big you up. The people. And, they, and yes, man, and they, and they, and they, me not, me not going to sing about them glass, them, them glass, them, them glass, the pile of gone. Because Miss, anyway, Miss Llewellyn, not Miss Llewellyn. Oh. Mm. What they are saying, teacher, from, from the thing with my daughter, when I go offering, she should, she, when it comes, she should have never been pushy. Mm. That is the reason why everybody get upset, teacher. Oh. Well. Let us see what the future holds for her, all right? And teacher, me love the thing that 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 that, that, that the player. Believe you me, I love it. I must keep shut up and get it. I love it. Teacher. Yes, man. I go and she put it out somewhere. To Learn to know when to, when to dance. Yes, teacher. Yes, you man. Me, me love it, teacher. Me love it. Me love it. Not tell you. All right. Up yourself. God okay, bless you. Yourself. God bless you. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. All right. Mm -hmm. Yes, students. A lot of you are here tonight. Remember to support my Z. All students, students, I need seven more people to contribute to my church. Um, cook out on Friday.
seven more persons to contribute to my church. Yeah. God bless you. God bless you all tonight. Yes, man. Mm -hmm. God bless you all tonight. Remember to like, subscribe, click the notification bell. My name is Andre Stevens. And this is the Andre Stevens Show. Until tomorrow night at 8 p.m. Jamaica. Walk good. Keep safe and be positive. Mm -hmm. Walk good. Keep positive.